welcome to Nemtech. My name is Nehemiah Wekesa and I'm glad to have you on board. So today we are going to begin a series on data science. And uh, before we dive into the specifics of what we are going to learn, uh, let's discuss why data science is such a crucial field in today's world. Now, in our digital age, data is being generated at a very, very high rate. Like, for example, when you just visit a YouTube, uh, a YouTube, then uh, you see a video you want to watch, basically you're interacting with that video. For example, when you like a video, you're interacting with the video. When you share, all the, all this information is being generated, like uh, that is being generated. Or, uh, for example, you want to purchase something online, your information is being uh, shared. So that is being generated everywhere. So on every click, purchase, and the interactions uh, leaves a digital footprint. So data science is the key to unlocking the value hidden within this vast uh, sea of information. By learning data science, you'll gain the ability to extract meaningful insight from complex data sets. You'll be able to make data-driven decisions in business and uh, in research. You'll be able to predict future trends and uh, behaviors. You'll be able to solve the real-world problems across uh, various industries. Now, also you realize that nowadays, uh, things are uh, moving towards the direction of AI and automation. Now, with data science skills, you'll be able to contribute to the cutting edge uh, technologies like uh, AI and uh, machine learning. And also opportunities are very, very wide in data science. So the demand for skilled data scientists continues to grow very uh, rapidly across all sectors. Now, by mastering data science, you are opening doors to a wide range of exciting and lucrative career paths. Uh, for example, you can be a data scientist, you can be a machine learning engineer, you can be a business intelligence analyst, you can be a, a, a data analyst, you can be a quantitative analyst, you can be a data engineer, you can be an AI researcher, you can also be a data architect, and then uh, you can also be a chief data officer. And uh, these roles are found in diverse industries, including the tech, uh, finance, healthcare, e-commerce, entertainment, and more. The median salary for data scientists in the US, USA data research, it is quite good. It's above $100,000 um, per year. Now that you understand the significance of learning data science, so in this series, we are going to cover several programming languages. We are going to begin with Python. Uh, which is the backbone of the course. And then uh, we also have R, we shall also uh, learn R. This is also another powerful language for uh, statistical uh, computing. And then uh, we shall also learn uh, data manipulation and uh, uh, analysis. And uh, the tools that we'll be using is spreadsheets. Spreadsheet, we shall use it for basic data handling and analysis. We shall also learn uh, SQL. This one is to work with the relational databases. And then now we shall also learn Power BI. This is for creating an uh, interactive data visualization. And then uh, we shall also learn the Python libraries like uh, Pandas for uh, data manipulation and uh, analysis. We shall also learn NumPy for numerical computing. We shall also learn SciPy for scientific computing. Now we shall also learn Matplotlib and uh, Seaborn for data visualization, the same to Power BI. Remember Power BI is good for creating interactive and uh, uh, interactive data visualization. We shall also learn scikit-learn for machine learning. Now the key concepts and uh, techniques in this series that we shall learn include regression analysis. We shall also talk about the natural language processing or sometimes the we call it NLP. We shall also talk about the data cleaning and uh, pre-processing. We shall also talk to, uh, talk about the uh, exploratory data analysis, uh, EDA. We shall also talk about the statistical inference. We shall also learn a machine learning algorithm. We shall also talk about uh, data processing. And uh, to ensure that uh, you've mastered every concept or uh, maybe you are good with machine learning, we shall cover 20 projects. Like at the moment, we are doing the series on the web app projects. Like uh, for me, I like whenever I teach, I try to provide uh, some projects so that you may know how you can utilize the techniques or uh, technologies you've learned, la programming languages, to do something to solve a real world pro um, you know, problem. So basically, we'll do about 20 projects. 
and guys, basically we will be uploading the uh, the courses or maybe episodes on this uh, playlist called uh, um, data science uh, there's a new playlist that uh, we are going to create called data science at the moment it doesn't have anything but uh, we are going to create here a new playlist called data science where we'll be uploading the videos then the latest videos so make sure that you go to the name tech search for name tech it is n e h m t e c h and uh, first of all make sure that you subscribe make sure that you subscribe because uh not in most cases i'll be sharing with you like uh, one on one uh, make sure that you subscribe so that whenever i upload you'll be notified and um uh, uh you know learn so it will be step by step and uh, and uh it will be project based like uh, for example if we learn python we'll be developing we'll be building uh the algorithms and uh you know a lot of stuff it will be project based like uh, anything you learn you will see how you can use that thing in the real world scenario so this is the site this is the youtube channel it is name tech and then uh, make sure that you subscribe and uh, if you wish to join the membership you can join that is to support me and also you'll have exclusive packs and then apart from the youtube i'll be i'll be uh, also adding the content on this on our lms learning management system so what you want to do is to search for nametech.com it is n n e h m t e c h uh, dot com and then what you do you just click on the my portal my portal and then ensure that you enroll with the google uh, this one is much easier so connect with google called data science now at the moment we have these other courses but uh, we are going i'm going to include data science as well because this is just an intro so uh, any content that i'll be creating for youtube i'll also provide it on youtube so in case you don't find it here just first search for data science and data science data science and then a search you'll find it at the moment is empty because i haven't created a course yet but i'm going to work on it in a few so make sure that uh, you uh, create a portal you 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 log in you log in to our portal so that you may have access to uh, everything including a lot of stuff here you can see these are the features you are going to have access to it and uh, the system is uh, user friendly so make sure that you also uh, sign up to this because we'll be providing the course let me show you uh, an example on how these lms look like for example if you want to learn the kotlin now for example if it is kotlin you'll be able to see like uh, the rating of that course you'll be able to see the instructor the number of the enrolled students and then a, a brief description about the course then uh, here we have the overview and then now uh, we have the curriculum then now uh, we have the reviews at the moment we don't have any reviews you can write a review to a course and then uh, here you can see the course details the duration uh, how many lectures are there and at the level and all that so if you want to access the course to learn for example if it will be data science you just click on the start course and then now here you'll be able to see uh, uh you know content like a step by step or maybe from the very introduction to the end so when you uh, learn and then uh, you've managed to finish a course you can just click on the complete and then out to the next so this one is going to uh, make it a tick like it's going to tick there that you finished uh, that uh, chapter then it will uh, it will uh, move to the next and then you can see it also displays the progress so if you don't want to see this stuff you can just minimize this one so that you can have a clear a big uh, um you know a uh, display so if you want to see the chapters you can always click on the curriculum then you'll be able to see it and then it's also uh, available on in the small screen so guys uh, basically i welcome you to the data science series and uh, it is completely free you are not going to pay anything but if you want to have a one-on-one -on -one, um, session with us basically you can write me an email i'm going to provide here an email in the description and also you can see it on the screen there uh, i'm going to uh, you can write me an email and uh, i'll give you the quotes because now one-on-one -on -one is a paid uh, is a paid uh, version and also it's going to be more detailed more detailed but uh, also it is available here for free on youtube but uh, this doesn't doesn't cover like uh, the deeper remember the advantage of having a one-on-one -on -one session you'll be able to ask question 
and I'll answer in real time and uh, you'll be comfortable to do something. But also if you are, you, you are just feeling that you don't have anything you want to learn for free, I uh, basically have here on YouTube and then also on our LMS. Make sure that you follow us, our pages. Make sure that you follow our pages on TikTok, on YouTube, on uh, Facebook, Twitter, uh, and all those pages. So guys, uh, uh, thank you so much and uh, let's uh, journey together. Thank you.